Hi guys, welcome, welcome to, to Being Wendy. Wendy. channel guys thank you guys so much for the feedback we got from our last actually our first video we did not expect that she actually had a goal for a hundred views i did not even expect people to watch it let me just say that but we thank you guys so so much we really appreciate it and we promise you guys we're going to give you more content you guys are going to have so much fun and hey so much fun anyway so much fun and trust me you're going to enjoy it so today we're going to discuss reactions how we first found out we we're pregnant and then how we reacted our boyfriends our parents our friends and the parents to our boyfriend oh yes our in yes the parents to our boyfriends yeah in love as she would say boyfriends or baby daddy oh baby daddy, oh, baby daddy. Oh, baby daddy. Oh, baby daddy. <laughs> Our baby daddies. Yeah, so yes. we're going to tell you how they all reacted and trust me, you guys, you are not ready for this. So, okay. Yeah, so um I found out I was pregnant last year. That was in November. Was it November or December? I think it was like December, yeah. So a lot of drama had happened like before and I was not really in my element. Like I was really sad. <laughs> Like I lost a lot, a lot of weight. I literally got below like 50 kg, which is yeah, I know, like 48 kg, which is a normal weight. So yeah, for me that was really, really a blow. Yeah, so when I found out I was pregnant, I was really, really happy, and it didn't hit me that I have to tell my parents first. So in my head, I'm just like, yeah, I'm pregnant, and my boyfriend was happy too. And then I sat down and I was like, oh my god, who is going to tell my parents that I'm pregnant? I'm thinking about my dad. I'm like, oh my god, who's so going to bad. tell that man that I'm pregnant? You know, like you know how they that father daughter bonding, yeah? So I was like, ha. Huh. As much as me and my dad are close, I was like, no, who's going to tell this man that I'm pregnant? Then I think about my mom. <laughs> I was going crazy. My mom is a no-nonsense person, so I was like, oh my god, who's going to tell her that I'm pregnant? But, yeah, I was like, at the moment, let me just enjoy the fact that I'm bringing, like, a whole new life into this world. Like, this is going to be the most beautiful thing I'm going to ever do in my life, like nothing compared to motherhood. I was just like, oh my god, I can't wait to see how my baby is going to look like. Like all these things just came into my mind, like how I'm going to shop for my baby, how we're going to have so much fun, how we're going to take pictures, how I'm going to like do these Snapchat filters on him because I feel like that's what people normally do to their babies. <laughs> yeah, so I was really excited. <laughs> yeah, imagine. So um, the way I told my parents that I was pregnant was I called my dad to a restaurant in town and I did not go alone. I went with the mother to my boyfriend and we told him and you know what my dad said? My dad was like my dad like did a small chuckle. He was like this is a very funny story. A funny story, how is this a funny story? No, but to him he's normally so he's He's like a bit like understanding. Yeah, he is. But at that time, you know, you don't know what yeah. you expect. Like in your head, you just know your parents are going to freak out. Like, Snap. you just don't expect them to be supportive about it. So he was like, this is a very funny story. And I was like, okay, so after here, what are we supposed to say? And then he was like, have you told her mother? And we were like, no. He was like, okay, just come home tomorrow and tell her mother that she's pregnant. Hey, my God. I almost went and to the funny eyes. part. When he got home, he didn't tell your mom. He didn't tell my mom. <laughs> so we planned a meeting. We were like, we we're going to go back home. Because at the moment, I was not staying home. So we were like, I'm going to go back home and tell my mom that I'm pregnant. And we told my mom to go and tell my dad that we're going to come for a meeting the next day. Oh, my dad. 
I think he also got scared because he was like, hey, I'm not telling uh, Wendy's mother that she's pregnant because he did not know how she was going to react. So the next day we came and saw my mom. She was like, hey, how come you guys didn't tell me you were coming? And I was like, I thought dad told you that you were coming. And she was like, no. So we told my mom that I was pregnant and she was like, oh, we expected anything. It's okay. Come on, in Toto to Talea in Kiswahili. That means if it's a baby, we're going to take care of him or her. So yeah, I was really, really shocked. I expected my mom to be like, Rudy man, you may talk and like go back to where you came from. Get out of my house. Walk up. Like, what, what have you done? Do you know how old? Yeah, exactly. Like, do you know how old you are? And I was like, I literally, I was in shock. I was just looking at her like. I think this is a clone of my mother, like this is not my real mother because my real mother wouldn't react like that. But at the end of the day, it was like a big relief to me. Like I was like, oh my God, thank you God so much. Like, they reacted this support. way and they've been so supportive. Like right now, this is literally, it's like it's not even my baby, it's like everyone's baby. Everyone's baby. My parents are so obsessed with him, like I just thank God for everything. Yeah, so... I think that was a really good reaction. So guys, don't really like judge in your head and say that my parents are going to be mad, my parents are going to be angry. Like, you never know. A baby changes a lot of things, trust me. You're not even ready for the reaction your parents would have. So just have an open mind about it. And yeah, your angels will come through for you like they did for me. Okay, hi, my reaction story is very unique not very unique almost cliche actually yeah okay so i found out i was pregnant in march which is like a one month yeah i was saying like it just hit me today when i was taking a shower do you know you had your belly piercing when you were pregnant yeah <laughs> let me tell you let me tell you so i didn't know i was pregnant for a while so that time uh before before i tested we went to the rent to town, some place, ink, yeah, ink, something. I don't know what it was called. Yeah. Ink, ink, yeah, ink something. So I, I think you guys know. Yeah. 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 So we went. I wish this was a paid ad, <laughs> <laughs> but it's not. So anyway. Okay, so uh, it was the same time. Yeah. 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 I was so stressed. I called her. I called our other friends. We have we have like a circle. So what they were talking. Everyone's like, no, just calm down. It's okay. You are doing to do. Like me. she was literally going crazy. I was going mad. Like it was so it dramatic. Wasn't a good thing it was like time. she even made me feel like, oh my god, why am I even? Yeah, like, I know. Because she made it look like this is the such worst a bad thing, thing ever. that can happen to you. Like she was. Oh, that, that, I think that, she that. got like. Her world just stopped at that moment yeah, it did. when she found out she was pregnant. She was like, like that's nah, it. Nah. It's over. It's the end I of the world. I can't you know? because for me, I put myself out there a lot. I have so many friends. I go to so many schools. So many people were watching me, and then I do charity work. So my life was literally out there. So as if for me, this was like, oh no, it can't happen. So I didn't tell. A baby daddy till after like two weeks and then i told him and he's like no we have to keep this baby three what what you know oh god will punish us oh <laughs> you know that? so, yeah he said that he said it's a sin against god don't abort okay so uh it was like that and then later with uh he conv he talked me into it and then I realized I didn't have a boat to, to a boat. So we had to tell our parents. But then I took out to my chipanga. So telling my my I told my parents they were pissed. They were so pissed. Mad. Pissed. Mad. Pissed. pissed. my dad yeah. he didn't believe it he, he felt like it let him down so much because i'm the first born it was unexpected no one saw this coming and you know so many people look up to me because i'm the i'm like among the first of in the short she's the role model 
in the, I'm the nice one. Yeah. Even in this, uh, I'm so the now her parents are just like, sa, sa. now we are also going to get babies from other and people. That, you know, drama. Like this has bars. opened a gate to more <laughs> flying babies. <laughs> <laughs> to more problems. <laughs> but eventually, uh, we worked things out. And yeah, my parents have been so supportive. They love my baby. It's a girl. And yeah, so so far we we, we have really supportive parents. Yeah. Baby daddies are so supportive. Very supportive. Very our friends are the best. Trust ever. me, you guys, when you get like I saw this one thing, like yeah. get pregnant and you know who your friends yeah, are. True. Like I know it's, it's so true. true. It's extensive to go to that point, like but you get yeah. pregnant, but this is actually really true. When you get pregnant, you know who's there for you, and who's, who's not, not there. It's just like fake friends, yeah? When you have good things, they want to be there for you. And when you have nothing, they won't be there. When you're in trouble, they won't be there. It's yeah. the same they with run. pregnancy. Like, you need to have like a really good support system yeah. in terms of friends. Because that's the only way you yeah. make it. Because our friends have been so supportive. Like, big up to those girls, they know themselves. Yeah, like they've been so, so supportive. And... I don't think I'd ever ask for any other friend, to Aww. be honest. Like, we've known each other for so long, and it's just amazing that they get to see our babies grow up. Like, we all grow up yeah, together, it's like, you know? it's like we got babies for everyone. It's like they're all mothers, but, yeah, and now we're all, all to, like, raising yeah. our kids together. Like, it's, it's so, so amazing. Nice. It's so beautiful. So, and then our in-laws, because we're not yet married, yeah. not yet married, uh, our oh, that's another topic for discussion, like getting married, yeah, you know, for the stage and Yes, but mm, the parents to our baby daddies are also amazing. Also. They they come, they visit us all the time. Yeah. We we're really in a good like. I really lives. don't know what I would do without my mother-in-law. Yeah, 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 yeah. Contact for you. Like she's she so was amazing. There the whole time. Like she was there the whole time. She really, really took she's care so of me. She's pregnant, and I don't think I could thank her enough. Like she just made everything thank so you. easy for me. Like I don't know. Like it's, so, it's just yeah. Say thank you. You haven't heard me say no, thank you. Knows. Like thank you so much. <laughs> I love you so much. So, yeah, it's been really amazing, you guys. So yeah, uh, lessons. Let me from my from my story. If you're pregnant and you're freaking out, be courageous about it. If you if you really know you're going to keep this baby, be courageous. At least keep your baby. And then have a plan with your baby daddy. Or if they are not there, have a plan on how you're going to tell your parents. And then stick to that plan. It's best, actually, I, for me, they reacted so badly because I said it myself. If I'd come with the guy, probably they'd have seen, oh, so he's around. Yeah, because so probably they were yeah, like, the guy doesn't want, want the baby, anymore. so now she's going to be left alone. Like, who's going to help her with all these responsibilities, you know? So they also start panicking on your behalf. Yeah, so it's... It's that. Have a plan. Stick to the plan. And throughout your pregnancy, enjoy it. Enjoy it because you don't want your baby it's having negative. Yeah, you're not, yeah, you're not even supposed to be stressed. Yeah, you're not supposed to be stressed. Eat. Eat everything you eat. Add weight, man. Hey, take that OG. Yeah, and don't get us wrong, guys. We're not encouraging young girls to have babies. Don't get us. Yeah, wrong. but we're saying if, like if you do you end get up to that having situation, a baby, like. Trust me, it's not. Yeah, easy. Don't, don't. It's not easy, but then again, it's not the worst thing that can ever happen. Like if you're watching us easy. right now and you're not pregnant, don't get pregnant. If you're yeah, not it's, not it's, it's not easy. It's not easy because for us, we had to like get into the like be really careful. Yeah. Because most most times when a young person gets pregnant, it's um it, it wasn't planned. For, yeah. But the babies are blessings. They're they are the best. Yeah. So guys, take care of yourselves out there. And if you're pregnant and you're watching this, keep your baby. Please keep your baby. Trust me. Or talk to us. Talk yeah, to like, us. Reach out to us. In then we'll talk to you. Like, we're going to put all our information for you guys. And trust me, you guys, you will not be disappointed. You yes. will not. So like, comment, share, share and subscribe.
and thank you guys so much for watching we'll be back with another video so bye